What's up, YouTubers? Johnny DIY here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to sharpen your lawnmower blade. If you guys are new to this channel, consider subscribing. I do a lot of uh, household DIY and automotive videos. Alright, let's get to it. First thing we're going to do is go ahead and disconnect that spark plug wire so there's no chance of this baby starting. To gain access to the blade, the best way of doing it is just to lean the mower straight back and if you've got to wait for someone to hold it, that way none of the oil will seep into the engine or gasoline. So now here's our blade. You're going to want to sharpen this about two to three times a season, but an easy way to tell is just grab a blade of your grass after you've cut it. And if you look at it, see how ragged and jagged the top is? It should be uh, more like it was cut with scissors, not all ripped. Now we'll just go ahead and unbolt the blade. <sighs> There we go. So here's that cutting edge on this one. See how dull it is? Go ahead and clamp it down. Now you can go ahead and clean it up. Get yourself like a flat flat head or a grinder or a sander. Now we're just going to take a metal file. Or you could use like a grinder and a flap disc. And we're going to grind down this edge right here. I'm just going to draw it out. Do it in one smooth motion, not like this. That will just mess up your file. I'm just gonna follow the line of the blade that's already there. All right, it's getting dark, so I got out the angle grinder. You'll want to check in with it every once in a while, make sure you're not taking off too much. Let's do the other side now. Alright. Alright, so now once you're done sharpening, go ahead and put a nail in. Um, your workbench or something and uh, put it on there and see how it balances looks like it's a little heavy on this side so maybe just take a little more off of this side so the blade will be balanced all right there we go that's good now let's go ahead and put it back on and now don't put it upside down so you want the trailing edge the edge opposite the sharp edge the one that's angled upwards that's gonna go up towards the deck up so your blades are going to be down. The dull flat surface is going to be pointed down towards the grass. Now it doesn't matter that it's convex. Different blades are different. Now see this blade, this actually installs opposite with the con uh, cave facing upwards. See that trailing edge is facing up so the blade would go like this. So don't put it on backwards. I like to put a little anti-seize on the mating surface this surface that's going to connect to the blade because sometimes that gets uh, rusted right there and also on the bolts put some anti-seize because this is exposed to water and it gets they get rusted on there pretty good all right now we'll tighten down everything good and tight I want this baby flying off <laughs> all right now we can connect our spark plug again Alright guys, and that's it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to my channel so you can check out all my new videos. Hit the bell icon, then you'll get notified. Alright guys, thanks for watching Johnny DIY. Keep on doing it yourself. Take care. And happy mowing.